Hey everybody, I'm glad you made it over to the science page here. If this is your first time here, uh, there has already been one day last week where we did a lesson. So if this is your first time, do this. Go back down to this kind of dark burgundy thing here. Uh, I want you to watch this video. Um, it's a short one, but it's really interesting. Uh, for some reason, it won't allow me to, to go full screen, but I don't know, who knows, permissions or something. So not my video, but really cool to watch. Watch that. And uh, then this is the science video. So watch through here and you can take some notes as you go, um, but the notes are also here as well. So you can open up both of those. This, uh, this just walks you through step by step and we talk about the points. Um, and then this one here is just the actual notes themselves with all the points and pictures. So if you, if you find yourself falling behind, no big deal. You can go back and look here and, and write them at your own pace, but write them all down. Good to do that. So if you have done that already, then uh, this is today's right here. So there's two things to do today and it's really quite short. I'm, I'm going to put uh, at least one up this week. I might put another one up, but I might, I probably will just wait till next week. This is the first thing you want to do is click on here. And these are scans of um, a BC science textbook. And it's pretty funny. Our scanner wasn't working, so I had to do it a different way. So um, the scans kind of have these weird curvy, it's, supposed to be correcting to a rectangle, but it doesn't always work well. So the curvy lines in there, here, look at this composition. Hmm. Um, just, just go with it and do your best to read it. So the text is important. You can read through, it wouldn't take you very long. I think those of you that are readers will zip through this very quickly. Um, this page actually goes on to the next page that works better in an actual textbook rather than a, a digital textbook. But yeah, this A here connects with down here, this B, C, D, and that's the layers of the earth and the different, four different layers and the different description of each one. And then, um, yeah, this talks about these two terms, lithosphere and this asthenosphere. And um, yeah, it's really cool stuff. I love our science. I wish I was there to teach it with you, but have a read through. Um, and those, uh, that text is to be used for this work package here. It's really short. There's only three pages and you can write right on this page. And when it comes to submitting this, I'll probably just get you to take a picture of it and share it with me on Google Drive. But you're going to draw a diagram here of, of Earth's four layers. So um, try to make it to scale as best you possibly can. If we were in class, we'd take a lot of time to do this. But look at some models online. Google this and look at a cross section of Earth or what it looks like. And you only need the four layers. There's about 13 layers um, because each one is divided into subsections. But from the outer... Uh, I was gonna say outer crust from the crust down it's this outer layers crust and then there's a big layer called the mantle and then the outer core and then the inner core so I want those four drawn there you can pick your colors and then there's a brief description of each one down below or just the four and and something about them this page is just a, 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 a matching page and you can use the text for that um, and then we have understanding the structure of our earth you can see the curvy lines again here kind of crazy but uh, just go with it, embrace it. Um, there's questions just about the layers again, and that's from the text. So that's all I want you to do. It won't take very long. Um, it's a quick little lesson, but make sure, like I said before, make sure you go back, watch that original video, um, write those original notes, and then we'll work on these things here. Okay, more to come on science. Uh, remember also to check in with uh, the homepage, and there's some times we're going to be keeping office hours, which means we'll be online on our Google Meet page, which is Claiborne 8 j um, at certain times every day for you to, to access us or just to check in or touch base or get math help or science or English or whatever the case may be. So check in on those. Uh, we'll talk to you guys soon.